In 1988, a small movie theater in Budapest, Hungary, burnt to the ground, killing the 56 people who were watching the film. The film that was screening was called Antrim. It's such a disturbing story, Antrim. It's kind of the holy grail of underground cult films that no one has seen. It makes people very nervous. Except for a handful of film festival programmers who are now dead. People say that the film is cursed or possessed. But I felt very different watching that film. Antrim is not safe. <laughs> You know of uh, Nakata's Ringu, Verbinski's The Ring, Carpenter's TV movie uh, Cigarette Burns, all about movies that, that kill people, but Antrim is that movie. There were festival programmers who mysteriously died. <laughs> the theater in Budapest burned down. <laughs> then there was the riot and trampling. <laughs> Because I had heard the rumors. There's a lot of rumors around this film. There are real people that died. There was that fire. I mean, why do people go to horror movies? Because they want to be scared. It just gets under your skin. What a beyond being scared. Something could mess you up forever. It's sad to play. It can really play games with your mind. Because whatever it's planted in the human mind, it lingers. It can even cause you to have a nervous breakdown. Why the hell did someone do that? No, it was like the work of the devil. <laughs> it went from angelic to demonic. I mean, that's what, what, what happens when people watch this film. They're going to be vulnerable to the devil. There are dark elements in music. There are dark elements in film that can cause people to do things that they might otherwise not do. Things are happening to people who are watching the film. Or it could be just a coincidence. Some people don't think it exists. Some people claim to have seen it and lived. And now apparently, you guys have found it. So... If you have an intention to watch the movie, you better watch it with somebody else. Alright, I just got what